Okay, this how-to video is going to show you how to use the import and export um, XML features for AutoCAD Capture. So they basically give you the ability to uh, import or export um, a design XML or a library XML. So we can import those files and we can also export those type of files. Um, it can be quite useful if you if you prefer to, to write um, your schematic designs or your libraries using XML, you can actually Get, a, get an example of what one looks like, so export a, a, a resistors library for example, make some changes to that file and then import that back in with some added resistors if you want to do it that way um, and it can save you a bit of time if you'd rather do that than, than drawing the schematic symbol yourself. So just as an example, we'll export a library XML file, we'll just browse to the schematics, so let's go and find out where my schematic libraries are. So I've got one here called resistors, I'm just going to write out a resistors or XML file We'll click OK and that writes my, my XML file out. So just as an example, let's go to that directory. And I've now got this resistors XML file, which we can just open up with a text editor. And if you're happy doing kind of XML editing and changing, you can obviously do that, that, that edit here. Once you've done that, you can then use that file to, to build a new library file for you. So it's literally file, import, library XML. I'm going to browse for that file, so there's my resistors file. Uh, I'm going to give it a different name here, I just want to use a, a new library, let's just call it test. Um, and I can obviously just get it to, to just don't overwrite everything, re re create a brand new library, add an existing library etc. So different different choices for how you want the, the XML import to be. Um, you can specify a log file, let's click OK and that will then write a test library, so we can then do file open library. Let's go to that directory. We've now got a test one library and it contains my, my library parts, my resistor parts. 